And now, a very special honor, getting to interview the Blue Power Ranger, Mr. David Yost himself. How are you doing today? I'm very good. Thank you for asking. It's a pleasure to be interviewing you. How's it going this week? Is it good with the, the BentCon? Anything special happening? Uh, well, BentCon obviously is special just in general because it's a lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, intersex, and questioning uh, Comic-Con. So it's, it's great for uh, gay people to be able to come and share together and share our love for all things nerd. <laughs> all things nerd. That's exactly what I like, your my type of man. <laughs> and uh, so you were the Blue Power Ranger. Can you tell me a little bit about, about that experience? Yeah, I uh, starred on a series called The Power Rangers, and I was the blue guy. I was the intelligent, nerdy one of the group. I made a lot of inventions and was the scientist, scientist and always thought my way out of uh, trouble as opposed to just jumping into fighting. And then when all was said and done, I'd have to fight a little bit as well. Uh, the process, obviously, was very exciting to be involved with such a successful TV show and a show that influenced so many uh, kids over the years. Right. Yeah, so I bet you're a really big icon for kids these days. Yeah, I mean people call us icons. I struggle with uh, using that word uh, when it comes in relation to me, but that's what people say. So if it's true, it's true and I'm obviously honored to uh, have represented a character that has helped kids uh, through difficult times. Awesome. You're a good good man. You're a good man, David. I try. <laughs> and if you were to give any advice to people who are wanting to follow in your footsteps, maybe to be an actor or some like just a good person, what what are you <laughs> what's some, what's some advice you would give? Well, uh, to be a Power Ranger, obviously it's really important to uh, be physical. So uh, if you're good at gymnastics, at martial arts, or dancing, that's always a good a good way in. Um, and to be an actor, obviously acting classes I do feel are important, but just get your butt to Los Angeles or New York and look for open casting calls and just go on everything that you can and uh, see what happens. But most importantly, believe in yourself um, and be convicted in what it is that you want to do. Conviction is everything. Conviction is everything. Amazing words. Really great words. Now, are you, a, are you, a, I just, I'm curious, you're really in shape. Are you a CrossFit guy or like P90X or like what? I'm not as in shape as most gay guys, but thank you. Uh, there's a ton of guys that look way better than me, but uh, no, I, I run and I lift weights. That's basically my thing. I would like to, I would like to try uh, CrossFit. I don't know about rolling those giant tires, though. I see some of that stuff, and I'd probably end up killing myself. Yeah, I don't know about rolling giant tires, either. I'm not really not into it. But thank you so much. You're welcome. This is David Yost, Whitney Rice, with ID8 TV.